hi guys welcome back to my channel i hope you all are doing great if you're new to my channel my name is candace i'm Riley west and i invite you to subscribe to my channel if you want to see more give this video a huge thumbs up and also turn on your post notification so you won't miss any time i upload a video in today's video i have a haul from pennywise and i also got some items from wonderful world so we're gonna start with the wonderful world items first for all of my south viewers did you know that there's a wonderful world in carlton center in san fernando i did not know that until i visited the one in gulf city and the girl directed me to the one in san fernando so i went there and the first thing that i picked up was a pair of false eyelashes so they are from the brand Adele and it says Four Mink Wispies. So I'm going to try to show you all it. I did use them and they still have glue on them. So they're not really sticking. But hopefully you can see how they look there. So I paid $50 for these. I also got this Elegil Pro Concealer and the shade is Toffee. Now I have used this before and I have it in the shade Almond. But hopefully you can see that the almond is lighter than the one that I just purchased, which is Tuffy. And the almond has a bit of a pink undertone, which I didn't really like too much on my face. But this one is like more brown with a yellow undertone. So it works better for my under eye highlight. And this was $30. My final wonderful world pickup is this eyeliner. It is from the brand Nika K New York. 24 hour waterproof eyeliner and i'm using this eyeliner on my brows do you get a pattern here but i really really like this i used it this is the second time using it on my brows and i think it really turned out well before i was using the ColourPop one and the ColourPop one is thinner than this one is so let me roll it up so you can see so it is a little bit thick the ColourPop one is thinner, so when I use the ColourPop one, it gives me more of a precise application. But this one, I just have to really take my time with it, and I do have to clean up my brows. So I did clean up with some foundation today, and I paid $30 for this. It is in the shade Dark Brown, if I didn't say before. Now on to the products that I got from Pennywise. One of my first purchases was this makeup sponge this is the sponge hair so it is from the brand Carla. i didn't know that it doesn't matter color anyway to the front but on it it says flawless blend urban studio ultimate blending sponge so it's pink in color and mine is dirty so let's let me put you onto the cleaner side so is this hot pink color and right now it is damp so it obviously expanded you can see the area inside where it was but how much bigger it is now right so this is my second time using it on my face today and I don't know what took me so long to buy a sponge. I was using the makeup brush and that was from the brand Coastal Scents. But a sponge just feels so much better on your face and to me it gives you a more flawless finish. So I am beyond happy and pleased with this purchase. And the cost of it was $34.95. One thing that I do want to mention is that I also saw this in Wonderful World and I think it was for around $40. So if you're looking to get this, pick it up in Pennywise. I repurchased this Dove deodorant spray. It says Invisible Dry, one quarter moisturizing cream. And the last time I got the smaller version of it, which was for around $12 or $13 maybe. And this one, which is the bigger version, is for $19.95. And I absolutely love this product and will definitely repurchase it. I got a pair of bath gloves. It is from the brand Carla. It says Body Refresh by Carla. It was $15.95. I like the color of it and I also like the texture and feel of it. It is not too rough for your skin. It has like a nice soft feel and yeah this is probably the best quality one that i've ever purchased i picked up a pack of disposable shavers it's from the brand gillette and it says daisy on it so it's five in a pack and this was 21.95 i also picked up this three pack of irish spring soap it was 17.95 and as you can see i've already used one i'm really excited to try this product and it is by the brand cream of nature it says pure honey moisture replenish and strength hair mask for dry and damaged hair now this product i have not seen i feel like this was the first time seeing this in pennywise and it was 50.95 
So it's a deep foundation, which I think is my favorite hair care product. I love to do deep condition. So it has a really nice smell. I can smell the honey in it and the texture. <laughs> I opened the giant Pennywise and I was like doing it this. Just to make sure that the texture was thick and that it wasn't runny because I don't like a runny deep conditioner. So I'm really excited, really, really, really excited to use this product. So I'll let you all know how this one goes. I wanted to give a little update on this product that I got from my last Pennywise haul. And it is an edge control from the brand Magic Collection and it is $14.95. When I went in Pennywise this trip, I saw some other colors in it. So the hold on this says five and I used it today on my edges. I didn't use a toothbrush or anything, so I used my big brush and it doesn't really give much of a hole. I would say like the hold on this is probably like a three and uh, it, but it does give some good shine. So I don't mind it with this kind of hole for my curly hair, but I feel like when I'm doing buns and I want a really sleek look, I would have to stick to my Eco Styler Gel. Those were all of the new products that I picked up this month. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any comments or questions, be sure to leave them in the comment section down below and I will definitely get back to you. All the items as well as the prices will be listed in the description box down below. So be sure to check that out. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also leave a thumbs up on this video. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys!